In this video, I'm going to show you how you can lock a bot in one specific channel. What do I mean by this? Sometimes when you add a bot to your Discord server, it speaks in every channel. So basically you will have different channels one and two, and then you will be talking about something different and then Pokemon bot appears out of nowhere, right? And that's very annoying. So I'm going to show you how you can lock the bot to speak only in one specific channel so that that problems, if you have it, goes away, right? So basically right now, just as an example, I've added Dank Memer. Now Dank Memer does have this option that you can like limit it to a specific channel, but some other bots don't. So I'm going to show you a way that will work with every bot, right? So basically right now we have this Dank Memer bot invited to our server, this meme, and it works in general. If I go to this other channel, it works in that other channel as well. That didn't even load. You know, so basically it works in every channel. Every time I type a command, it reads every channel. So let's find a way to change that. I'm going to create a different channel just for Dank Memer, right? So I'm going to right click, create channel, Dank Memer. That's good. So we have this one channel where Dank Memer is actually going to work and we're going to keep it just there. So you need to, first of all, kick out Dank Memer out of every channel. <laughs> yeah, boy. So let's do so right away. So first of all, we're going to right click on the channel and then we're going to edit channel and then permissions. And here is where you will be able to tweak all of this. So if you want a bot not to speak in a certain channel, you need to click here and the plus sign on roles. And then you need to look for the bots role. You click that. So now you're going to modify the permissions for the bot. So if you click this here, view channel, the bot is just not going to see that channel. So basically we can just click save changes and that will not allow the bot to see the channel, right? So if you do please meme, it just doesn't work because the bot is not seeing the channel. If you want to see how that looks, I want to show you if I go to server settings and then roles, if we go view as server role, if we go on Dank Memer, you will see that the general channel disappears because it just doesn't see it because you deny the permission for the bot to see that channel. So now, even if anybody types something there, it will not be able to respond to it. Now you can do that for every channel, but that's very tedious. If you have categories, that's why I created these categories, you can do it at a category level, which is way easier. So for example, I have all these channels, right? One, two, and three. If I go to the category, right click, and then edit category, permissions, and we do the same thing. We go to select the role Dank Memer, and then we do view channels. We click on the X, and then we select save changes. So now this bot does not see the channels within that category. Now a channel normally, if you didn't make any changes, will inherit. Inherit means that it will take the same configurations, the same settings from the category. But if you change something inside the channel, it could also not have the same settings. And that might be a thing. So if we go to edit the channel inside that category, you will see that you have permissions. And you see permissions synced with category hot channels, right? If we make any change here, for example, if we click um, on the thing it will tell you sync now because the changes in the channel specifically are different from the changes in the category so if you show this sync now button means that the settings in the channel and the category are different so if you want to have them the same just click on sync now and sync permissions and it will take the permissions from the category again right so that's just something to keep in mind um, so we can do it with the other categories as well just permissions, Dank Memer, view channel, save changes, boom. And now Dank Memer does not work in the other channels, right? Please meme, nothing. Please meme, nothing. It doesn't see in general, but we didn't make any changes here. So it does see this channel, right? Please meme, there we go. Please meme, there we go, right? But it does not work in the other channels. 
All right. Another thing that's helpful to keep in mind is that, for example, here on the right, it shows you all the users that are able to see the channel that you're in right now. For example, here in general, I only have myself because I'm the only one able to see this. But if I go to Dank Beamer, which is a channel that Dank Beamer can actually see, it will show you that it's right there. If I go to any other channel, it disappears because um, Dank Beamer cannot see those channels. So only the people that can see a channel are in this list. So why this is important? Because if you're trying to do this yourself and you see that um, you did it already, but Dank Beamer still shows on the right, it means that something's wrong. You gotta like start from scratch, find out a way to fix it. Or not that Beamer, but any bot, you know what I mean? Anyways, so yeah, that was that. I hope you found this video helpful. And if you did, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Have a wonderful rest of the day, my friends. And stay safe out there.